What's up, boys and girls? How are you doing? How are you doing? This is Safe with In a Gaming, and we're back in Rap Mechanics Bible. What we're going to do today? I'm going to teach you how to make a axle suspension. I, I guess I don't know. It's something I did. <laughs> I wanted like more like a realistic car would be, you know. <clears throat> so. I made this little beastie beastie. Okay, and I'm gonna show you how I did the axle. All right. <clears throat> let's see. Let's see. First, we need to go get some suspensions. And then up here, get this. Let's get these two suspensions. Let's get some. Well, okay, we got some bearings. Let's get some pipes. Yes, maybe we need pipes. I don't know. Yeah. Now we can grab, yeah, there's some tires down here. Just grab two tires. For the hell of it! And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a quick little bell of a car. Show you how I did the driving suspension on here. So, okay, let's, um, yeah, we're going to start with that, of course, and we're going to build this out a little bit, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how this drives after I show you. Like, all right, so what we're going to do is, let's just, I did eight wide because that's like basically perfect size for two seats plus a little side rail so it's up to you but that's what I'm gonna do again I'm gonna do just do eight wide five one two three four five six seven eight all right and then I what I used was actually a uh, let's see if I can find the piece this here so you guys can actually see what I use support structure that's what I use for the base mine I use two of those and that's what this is sitting on I think you can see it here yeah you can see it there and they're sitting there next to each other but I don't have two more so we're just gonna have to do it this way okay and do the, the middle out Hold on. let's see And yeah, we're just going to do it back like that. And then do it as simplistic as possible for now. Go two up. And then what that's going to do is bearings there. Probably need to move this a little bit so that's a, yeah that's much better just adjust that now we're gonna do our bendies bendies two bendies going down okay both sides Okay, now we're gonna go back to this. All right, I'm just gonna use the same material. That and uh, I only have one bearing. Hold on a second. Let me grab another bearing. In. <laughs> do do do. All right, and then you just add a bearing here. On the end, in, all right. Then we're gonna put our tires on there. And on here. Okay, so what I wanna do is I wanna grab this. Yeah. Grab this, and we're gonna put this directly under.
Okay, so this should give you an idea of what we it was, it's going to do. Okay, so now I'm going to remove this. And you see how that is, right? So adjust your suspension a bit. Alright, so what this is going to do is this would keep this straight while allowing this to bend if this was heavier. But basically you're going to mimic that on both sides, but on the front you're going to add some bends like that. This out of the way for now completely. Hold on. over here be this All right. okay you see how on here comes down and then goes across like this but then I did two bends here bracket for the turning bin our bearings or bearing and a bearing on the wheel and on the same side and in the back, it is right across, bearing, bearing on the ends. And I'm stuck underneath it. Alright, so how does this drive? Ah, it's dark out. Might have to wait till no yeah, the sun come up to really show this off. Go ahead and put it out here for now. I do like it at night though. East is, I like how, like, I've sunk the lights in and you can't really see the lights on the truck. There, from that angle. Same kind of back here. See the gas here. Uh, da, da, da. Engine on the side, you got the storage. You got like a storage here, like a glove box for your passenger. Okay, yeah, sunlight's coming up. So, so if we go over uneven surfaces, that just doesn't phase this. Beautiful, huh? It is nice and nice and nice and nice. Those are forms from me riding around in this, and it just uh, been around. You're running over little beasties, little robots. All right, there's a little jump here. Little jump over here. Let's, and there's a little ravine. I think it go off like. How well the suspension is here. <laughs> I didn't mean to jump that, but wow. Come on, come on, flip over. Oh no! Oh god. That was that, uh, that actually was a lot of fun. Okay, let's try that. I'm, I'm gonna try that one more time. You're a bot. Now, I have a saw up underneath, as well as I have a bed hidden under there. So if we died, we would spawn up underneath here. The saw blade keeps these guys from hitting the wheels. So if we, like, just went up to him. Oosh. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Having a good day? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Run away. Oh. Ducks. You're having a rough time today. Brace people out. Just running you over. 
Dude, I just love how this thing handles. And the fact that they won't attack because of the saw blade is just beautiful. I mean... It's kind of ridiculous that one of these little guys could hit your tire one time and then it's out of commission, right? I, I would totally be against the whole saw blade thing if it wasn't for that. Let's go through here again. Let's see if... Rock this time. What the... That jump is ridiculous. Okay. That's okay. That's not the jump I was really talking about. I did it twice now. That's I don't know. The jump is actually over it. But yeah, all I was wanting to show is just how well it goes in and out. There we go. Well, bam! Landed that. Look how beautiful that is. So that's a dual axle. And you can see the bed underneath there hidden. And I love how it just, just ah, uh, this is also four wheel drive. Just love how it spins. And I have oh, I have a master battery on the front there. As you can see, this is the uh, starter area's master battery. I skipped the whole starter area, and then I went grabbed a master battery. It <laughs> in a build for later, and it's just been sitting on my fence. And so I decided, why not use it for the front? It's indestructible, and it's heavy. And because I was like, I couldn't go fast at all. I was doing wheelies like, like it's trying to do now. Can I even drive through this? Oh, that's such a nice jump too. Wow, I want to do that again. Anyway, the, the battery really weighs down the front very well. And this is such a good vehicle just to run around the map on, explore a bit. I have to worry about anything really. Um, I have a level four engine in here, gas engine. I would like to get some more component kits that get this to level five, but that would just have to wait. There we go. Yes, and landed it. So yeah, it's a it's a cool vehicle. I like it. I mean, I like this suspension, the axle. So if you guys have any suggestions or any uh, questions, please do leave a comment down below. Um, if you enjoyed the video or learned something, go ahead and smash that like button. And if you're not subscribed and you want to help the channel out, it'd be lovely if you did hit that subscribe button. We'll be seeing you next time. Till then. I want to keep on driving. Peace out, guys. Bye-bye now.